Hey everybody, this is Brandon's Movie Corner, and it's time for a VHS, DVD, and Blu-ray update for April 23rd, 2019. In this update, I'm going to show two VHS tapes, three DVDs, and three Blu-rays. And yesterday, I received the DVD from eBay that I won as a bid auction last week. And today, I received... A lot of two VHS tapes which I also ordered last week and also today I got two DVDs and three Blu-rays at Walmart so let's not waste any time let's get started and we're gonna start with the two VHS tapes that I got from eBay and a lot today and normally I do show them in ABC order but I think you can probably figure out why I'm not showing them in ABC order this time but if not I'll explain why in a minute so the first VHS tape I got is the 1991 VHS of Every Which Way But Loose. This is a 1978 movie starring Clint Eastwood, and it also has Sandra Locke, Jeffrey Lewis, Beverly D'Angelo, and Ruth Gordon as Ma. This is a Warner Home Video Cheesy Shield tape, part of the comedy genre. Clint meets Clyde in an all-time comedy blockbuster. Rated PG, 114 minutes. Here's the vertical sticker label. It has two print dates, December 16th, 1994 and April 8th, 1995. So it's an obvious later printing. And the other VHS I got today, this is actually the sequel to Every Which Way But Loose. That being Any Which Way You Can. This is a 1980 movie, and this comes in a 1986 VHS box, but this tape is actually a much later reprint. I'll show you why in a minute. Again, starring Clint Eastwood. It also has Sandra Locke, Jeffrey Lewis, William Smith, Harry Gardino, and Ruth Gordon as Ma. And this was purchased from a store called Volo for Malls. Also part of the comedy genre, once again. Clint and Clyde come back in a knockout combination. Also rated PG and 116 minutes. Now have a look at this. It's got an ink label with the Boring Shield Warner video logo. And the print date is December 28th, 1997. This was actually printed on my mom's 34th birthday and my dad's 32nd birthday. And yes, my, both my parents had the same birthday, but they were born in different years. And I did check the opening of this tape and it does have the boring Shield Warner Home Video logo at the beginning. So yeah. And both these movies look pretty funny, so I'm gonna have to check them out sometime. So those are the VHS tapes. And now on to the DVDs, and I will point out which one I got from eBay. So, the first DVD I got, it comes in a 2019 slipcover, but the DVD itself is from 2017. And it is the Journey Double Feature, which includes Journey to the Center of the Earth and Journey to the Mysterious Island. Journey to the Center of the Earth is a 2008 movie, and Journey to the Mysterious Island is a 2012 movie. Discover two action-packed films that are sure to deliver fun for the whole family. Journey to the Center of the Earth stars Brendan Fraser, Josh Hutcherson, and Anita Bream. And Journey to the Mysterious Island has Dwayne Johnson, Michael Caine, Josh Hutcherson, Vanessa Hudgens, Luis Guzman, and Kristen Davis. And I actually do remember seeing some of Journey to the Center of the Earth when I was in sixth grade, and I remember it being pretty good. But I'm going to have to watch the entire movie and see what I think of it now. And I have not seen Journey to the Mysterious Island, but I will give that a watch after I watch the entire thing of Journey to the Center of the Earth. Journey to the Center of the Earth... Uh, Journey to the Center of the Earth is rated PG for intense adventure action, some scary moments, 92 minutes. Journey to the Mysterious Island rated PG for some, for some adventure action and brief mild language, 94 minutes can barely talk today.
and it's got both movies on one disc. Now this next DVD is the one I got from eBay and this is an ultra rare one. This is a For Your Emmy Consideration screener DVD of Malcolm in the Middle. Yeah, this was given out to the Emmy voters back then. Outstanding comedy series. I do have the first season of this show on DVD, which was the only one that was ever released in the U.S. And when I saw this on eBay, I just couldn't pass it up. It includes three episodes from the fifth season, which are Vegas, Ida's Boyfriend, and Dewey Special Class. Yep. Here's the inside. And it's designed to look like a popcorn box. There's a disc. And it even came with a custom bag of microwave popcorn. But since this is 15 years old, I'm obviously not going to risk eating this. So I'm just going to keep it in here just for fun. Yeah. And since Disney owns Fox now, I, I am hoping one of these days they'll release the remaining seasons of the show on DVD. And I did even hear that when the Disney Plus streaming service launches in November, this show is actually going to be part of it. Even though I more, I'm more of a physical media person than a streaming person, I actually might consider checking Disney Plus out when it's released in November. So, yeah. And now here's the last DVD, the 2015 release of Terminator Genesis. This is also a 2015 movie, and this is the fifth movie in the Terminator franchise, which I have the first Terminator on VHS and DVD, which the DVD is in a double feature set with Robocop. I have Terminator 2 Judgment Day on VHS and Terminator 3 Rise of the Machines on DVD. I don't have Terminator Salvation yet, but I actually did order the Blu-ray of that from eBay today. And I also did order some more movies from eBay and the Cinema Sickness Retro Store, which I'll tell you those in the community tabs if you want to know what they are. The best Terminator since T2 Judgment Day is Mark Hughes of Forbes. You are going to love this movie, says James Cameron, director of Terminator 1 and 2. New mission, new threat, new fate. And it stars Jay Courtney, Jason Clark, Amelia Clark, and Arnold Schwarzenegger. Arnold is back and better than ever, says Sean Edwards, Fox TV. One of the best action movies of the year, says Rick Bentley of the Fresno Bee. Rated PG-13 for intense sequences of sci-fi violence and gunplay throughout, partial nudity and brief strong language, 125 minutes. Here's the disc. So I'm going to have to rewatch the first three um, Terminator movies and watch Terminator Salvation after I get the Blu-ray of that before I watch this one. And I know there's... Another Terminator movie coming out in November. I think it's called Terminator Dark Souls, if I remember correctly. If I got it wrong, I'll correct it in the description, but I think it's what it's called. So, yeah. And now on to the three Blu-rays, which this first one is a steel book. And it's the 2014 release of Drive. This is my second Sony Pictures Home Entertainment Blu-ray steel book. The first one being Christine. This is a 2011 movie. Brilliant. You can get buzz just from the fumes coming off this wild thing, says Peter Travers of Rolling Stone. Special features list, you can just pause and read it yourself. And it stars Ryan Gosling, Carrie Mulligan, Brian Cranston, Christina Hendricks, Ron Perlman with Isaac, Oscar Isaac, and Albert Brooks. Rated R for Strong Brutal, Bloody Violence, Language, and Nudity. Approximately 100 minutes. And here's the disc.
I did hear this is supposed to be a pretty awesome movie, so I'm going to have to give this a watch someday. Now, the next Blu-ray, this is a movie I saw in theaters back in January. And it's the 2019 release of Glass. Also, 2019 movie with James McAvoy, Bruce Willis, and Samuel L. Jackson. From M. Night Shyamalan, the writer-director of Unbreakable and Split, which this movie is a sequel to both of those. I have Unbreakable on VHS and Split on Blu-ray. Unbreakable was an awesome movie and Split was pretty good. Yeah, and this movie was really good in my opinion. You cannot contain what you are. Shemalan's eccentric, intimately scaled superhero universe is Manola Dargis of New York Times. Here's the bonus features list. Here's the actual Blu-ray case itself. And it also has Anita Taylor-Joy and Sarah Paulson. Rated PG-13 for violence, including some bloody images, thematic elements, and language. Two hours and nine minutes, aka 129 minutes. There's the Blu-ray and the DVD. And if you want either the digital movie code or the free movie code, you already know what to do. Alright, here's the last Blu-ray. This is also a 2019 release, but this is a 2018 movie this time. Welcome to Marwin with Steve Carell. From the director of Forrest Gump, that being Robert Zemeckis. One of the most beautiful and brilliant films ever made is Ryan J. of Premier Networks. Imaginative and heartfelt is Sean Edwards Fox TV. Here's the bonus features list. And this movie also stars... Leslie Mann, Diane Kruger, Merritt Weaver, Janelle Monet, Isa Gonzalez, Gwendolyn Christie, Leslie Zemeckis, and Neil Jackson. Ray PG-13 for sequences of fantasy violence and disturbing images, brief suggestive content, the Mac material and language. And it's 1 hour 56 minutes, aka 116 minutes. And I know this movie got mainly negative reviews from critics, but... I actually still want to give this movie a try because I think it looks pretty good. So I'll have to watch it for myself and see what I think. Here's the Blu-ray and the DVD, both of which are on blue discs. And again, if you want the digital movie code or the free movie and more code, you already know what to do. So... Let me get this back in. And that's going to do it for my VHS, DVD, and Blu-ray update for April 23rd, 2019. Hope you all enjoyed, and this is Brandon's Movie Corner signing off.